Hi everyone, it's Cindy A. Lewis here and last week I went to Denver and I was able to share a Tuesday morning haul with you and I took some friends with me there and it was really great. Uh, we had a, a fun time, everybody saw the amazing things at Tuesday morning. But now that I'm back in town, I wanted to share actually a Dollar Tree haul with you that I picked up a few things. My mind is going like crazy with all these crafting uh, DIYs that we can do that I can share with you, that we can do on a budget, that we can do with things maybe we have around the house and just adding a few things in, or um, you know, just buying some things on you know that um, aren't too expensive, but we can just add some things together and just give you some ideas because what I'm here to do is inspire you and not uh, cr you know you don't have to create exactly what I create or you could but that'll just give you some tools to put your um, crafting uh, projects together and it's just really fun to do that so I'm going to share some things with you that I got at the Dollar Tree and just tell you a little bit about what I'm thinking about with um, those items and then <clears throat> you know because I get inspired from other youtubers that I watch and from other um, books and sources that I find craft projects in but I don't always do them exactly the same and you might not do that either so anyway I want to share those with you so let's get to it okay so the first thing that I wanted to show you were these frames that I got and I'm looking for two more of these um, five by seven they're kind of a shadow box type frame as you can see they're they have a lip and they have some um you know like more space in between the back and the front so i got two of these i need two more because um coupon to provide did a really cute jewelry um like square and she added some things to the outside that where you could hang your jewelry on. Well, I want to make it for crafting. And so I'm looking for two more of these, which they didn't have at the dollar store. But these are five by seven. So when I get those, we'll do um, a DIY on that. And I'll, I'll actually share her video with you as well. These are some 11 by 14 frames. <clears throat> and I got two. I have a couple of uh, DIY projects that I want to make with these and this would be like the base. This would be not the base like the bottom, but this would be the framing. This would help it to stand. I also use this for my, <clears throat> excuse me, my uh, 3D pumpkin picture that I made with burlap. And I think we could do something with a Christmas tree as well. So I'm going to look into that. Anyway, I got two of these. <clears throat> And they're really, really take paint well, and you can also cover them with, um, you know, like washi tape or whatever. Um, also, I got some paper clips. This is the 80 count, um, the covered large paper clips by Jot. Um, these are really nice for making uh, decorative paper clips for your journal, your uh planner, your uh, pocket letters, which we're going to go into that um, soon. So I'm, I wanted to show you those and they are a dollar for 80. <clears throat> the next thing I'm going to show you is <clears throat> something I found along the lines for Christmas and Dollar Tree that I went to has a lot of the battery operated LED lights and they have different kinds. These two are the small ones. And at Christmas, it seems like we're always looking for lights to um, put on our displays or put in vases with ornaments and pine trees, uh, pine tree, um, you know, like spruce limbs or branches, and then also with pine cones. And so um, these really are pretty and they had different colors like this one's blue and this one's clear they had red i believe they had amber and green and then also they had these with the little balls on top these are all led and then they had some stars so i went ahead and picked up some because <clears throat> the dollar tree doesn't always have everything all the time it seems like whenever i go to look for something it is gone already and uh, so I have to get it when I go now another thing I picked up was this pocket um, coupon holder it's a little file um, coupon holder it has an elastic 
uh, connector here and you just open it and it has these different um, file folders for your coupons, for stickers maybe, for checks, whatever you need. And I wanted to try it out on something that I'm thinking of, so um, <clears throat> I went ahead and picked up one. And for a dollar, it's really well made. I mean, it is pretty sturdy. The plastic is thick. It's, um, let's see, it, the measurement is um, 7 by 4. So it's about a 4 by 7. Really nice size. Another thing that I picked up were some stickers, and I want to show you the different kinds that I did pick up. They have these cute little monkeys, so cute. They're um, they're not 3D, but they're pop-up kind, and they're kind of thick. They're really adorable. You get 30 count, and I thought they would be a fun sticker to add to different projects that we do. And then I'm just amazed at these wall um stickers because they're clear and you can put them on your planners or or on your any to dress anything up a notebook or anything and it's just how you put them on there sometimes you can cut them apart and just use little pieces of them and sometimes you can just rearrange how it says this one is i was made for sunny days and this one is hello sunshine really cute they had love is patient um love is kind does not envy does not boast it's not easily angered um <clears throat> it always protects trusts hopes and preserves love never fails and i just love this this is galatian uh corinthians 13 1 Corinthians 13. And then God grant me the serenity <laughs> whenever um, the serenity prayer, whenever I checked out, the gal just said, oh, I need that today. So anyway, no telling what kind of day she was having. But anyway, these are a dollar. They're really nice. I'll show you. I've shown you on, on my notebook before. <clears throat> I took one of those just on a plain composition book. And put um, be the change that you're uh, you want to see in the world. So you be the change. So anyway, I put it on here, and it's just I like it. It's decorative and everything. And then inside the cover, I just added a few post-it notes that I can take with me, and a couple things like happy and identified myself, Cindy. I know who I am, but if somebody found my notebook somewhere, they might want to give it back to me. So <clears throat> anyway. A couple of other fun things that I picked up were these um, Paw Patrol, very, very popular with the young kids. And um, so I'm going to make a little gift basket for one of my little friends. It has 17 color forms and two backgrounds, so she can play with that. And you might be interested in that they had different ones. They didn't just have Paw Patrol. But they had, um, I think they had Disney princesses and different ones. So anyway, Paw Patrol. <clears throat> the next thing I got that would be great for um, for DIYs are these beautiful planners. Now, one thing with the planners is um, you can use anything to create a new cover or a divider. And so um, what, I, what I got these for was um, to show the different um, sayings that are on there because I, I love inspirational sayings and encouragement. I think we're getting a little glare anyway uh, off of this. But um, this one has like the cute little glasses. Let's see if you can see that without the glare. Maybe not. And, um, you know, wake up and make up. Be yourself, everyone um, else already taken so just be yourself anyway those were cute and then this one too this one has some beautiful sayings on the back of it so there's a lot you can do with a calendar besides using it for just a calendar and one thing that if I can just um, encourage you or inspire you is to think differently is because we can use it as a calendar, certainly, but we can use it for so much more. And the paper's really nice on the inside. And then I got one more, uh, Let Your Light Shine, which I love. 
that. That is really a, um, you know, like a motto of mine is bringing light into our world and being that light and being an inspiration. So anyway, check out your Dollar Tree. These are only a dollar and really nice. I did pick up some colored raffia to use for some projects. And I was inspired by this cute bow right here. So cute. It's, this one is pink. They had yellow and they had some other colors. And it's, it's light material and looks really simple. It came with this raffia here or string. But I thought, well, we could do something with this too. So we're going to have to make some, some bows with these, with this raffia. Along the line with the calendars, um, I did see these at the Dollar Tree. And they have like a tablet. It's not like a tablet. It is a tablet. They come with a tablet and they come with a little mini calendar. And they do have the magnet on the back, which you could use for something else. If you decided to use the tablet for your planner or for something else and the little calendar, I thought it's really nice. It could be added to any of your pages in your calendar if you needed to add that um, when you cover it up, maybe with your decorations or your, your uh, washi tape or your stickers. But if you still wanted the month calendar to be able to view on your week, these would be nice to have. So I did get a couple of these to try that out. And then I did pick up a few folders. Um, they had this one. I didn't know if you've seen this before, but the, the um, holes come out and go in. So if you wanted to put it in your notebook, you can, but then you just push it in if you want to carry it with you and that's not sticking out loose. And it has a, a button, a little snap here. And it's clear so you can see what's in it. So that's nice. I hadn't seen those before. And I did get two folders. I'm going to use these for DIYs, not for folders. But I like the colors and the decorations of them. And so um, they do have pockets. They have pockets inside. But I actually didn't buy them for their plastic. So I didn't buy them for being folders. The other, the other last couple things that I got, um, I did get some wire. They had some colored wire, um, and we can always use that for craft projects. And this is a six-pack. So there's two red, two black, and two of the silver gray color. And they are 33 feet long. And I don't know. Let's see. It's, it doesn't say what how thick they are but um, I needed some wire to do some projects the other day and I couldn't find any and I thought I had some but for a dollar I picked that up and I thought that would be nice and then for my station um, my craft room I wanted to go ahead and pick up some um, screwdrivers that I could just keep right here these were a dollar and there are six in there and I thought that would work for my little projects and then for gift baskets, it's always nice to have some um, the large plastic bags. The, this, this will shrink if you um, blow the blow dryer on it. But um, I don't always want it to do that. But that's the design of this is for the gift bags. So anyway, I picked up those few things. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope that you, um, I mean, we got a lot of cute little things that, at the Dollar Tree just a lot and um, they do have so many things that you can use for your projects so if you enjoyed this haul if you would give it a thumbs up if you would comment or if you would share my video it would help my channel to grow and I'm so thankful that you came by and visited with me on this channel. So have a great day and enjoy the rest of your week and I hope I've inspired you to success.